YouTube's a Jack Momo YouTube channel. Diana's Provitario, Proton and Raviti. Vitome, Maname Tome, Music Cantif. Delicious Fame, Sweet Heaven and Come. And I will promise you that you won't be disappointed whatsoever. So why don't you come and join me in discovering amazing, talented artists and bringing it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, my next reaction of today, I have reacted to before, and his, another song has been re recommended to me from her channel. So, this is Navka, and the song is Cossacks Rose to the Dawn. It's a Ukrainian folk song, and I've got here Zazif Gotap um, Zogzanki, and Z Zogzanchinki. There you go. So in the description page, there is some lyrical contents. It says, Navka singer took on the task of reviving an old and sometimes forgotten folk songs and launched an all Ukrainian project, Ukrainians in Songs. 13 winks, 13 Ukrainian songs that you could hear in a new way and 13 clips from the most charming places of Ukraine. This is the first project in Ukraine that will not only receive, re revive, Ukrainian folk songs, but also showed Ukrainians the most beautiful parts of Ukraine. So Zadif um, Zozenki is a Ukrainian folk song. I hope I'm pronouncing the name wrong. Um, and I know that I'm getting it slightly wrong on the pronunciation. So if you can break it down for me, that'd be amazing. So thank you very much for all that one. The author of which sometimes is attributed to the singer's girl from a Poltavia Mershula um, Chure. That's, that's the name of the girl, the girl, the singer. The song is about a Cossack, true to his duty, who goes on the road to protect their homeland. He is forced to leave his mother and his beloved girl. Okay. And it says, the, 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 so, it's the, so it's got the um, sulky Cossack training from different regions of Ukraine. Each of them extremely typical and most of the massive scenes of the video when Cossack campaigned to the war was 13, 15 horses were involved. Okay, so this looks like a hell of a lot of budget that's been put into this. This was three years ago that I'm reacting to. This. Something of that happened three years ago. It's got about 2.6 million views in those three years. So I'm I'm excited. I can't wait to to be diving into more Ukrainian traditional songs, and I can't wait to press the play button. So until so we we do it right now, shall we? Yeah. So, without further ado, you know what we're here for! <laughs> Great vocabs and a damn good video audio music! Can you dig it? So that's the training ground.
with Cossacks Rose to the Dawn. Ukrainian folk song. I've got here Zasvik got up Kozachenki. But also, I was reading down the bottom because all Kos listen to this, all Kazakhs collaborations, the real Kazakhs in there, with the Kozak um, Serki Shum, who takes care of the Kozak's training group in the village of Novi. I don't know how to pronounce it, that, the, the last pit, and I don't want to disrespect it by getting it so wrong, but it's near Kiev. Kiev. Um, the organised of the rival of the Kozaks from different regions of Ukraine who poses a different styles of weapons among them was musical Alexander, who played the Lear. So it's got so much significance in there. How? Wow! I need to now look, check out... So I've already reacted to one... So I've got another 11 more Cossacks folk songs to check out from this particular channel, from this particular artist. Between her and Elaine, or Olin, and, 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 and there is a number of Ava, um, Yelka, um, from, from the top of my mind, but there is a, a Klutz, there's a number of handful of young Ukrainians that are carrying a torch for Ukrainian folk songs. But also, from reacting to the Eurovision Song Contest and, you know, Tavolci won, which, you know, amazing group and everything else, there's a part of the young culture that's saying that they've kind of like, not saying that they had enough of the, the, uh, of the folk songs and Ukrainian elements on that, but they want to be more represented of the new modern vibes of music. And I think that they're getting kind of, they don't want to be pigeonholed by when you hear Ukraine, it's not you know, a folk song. You know, you're, you're expecting a folk song or you're expecting, you know, that Cossack or that subcompathian, I mean, the Carpathian um, elements of it. You know, because there's a lot of also EDM, there's a lot of other attribute, um, attributes to U Ukraine. But it's the younger, ver the younger uh, generation that are speaking out, saying, right, look, we love the folk songs. We grew up on, you know, on that element. We cannot forget what is happening. But we want to be incorporated with the Western, you know, with, with the rest of the world and in tuning with what they're doing. And, the, you know, the things of like Tavolci is... And not only Tavolci, but artists like Tavolci are at the at the forefront of trying to bring that out. But there's also the half of well, you know, that's scared of something new. That's scared of what you know. If this takes over, what will happen to you know the elements of the folk, Ukrainian folk songs and and the cultural history of va values? It's not gonna go away. It's like. Everybody who's everybody of every hundred or two hundred years will think about that. Every two hundred years, the older generation will think about what the, the things that the younger generation may lose. Then they're not going to be picking up, or they're scared of that. 
the younger generations always do well. The younger generations will always fall on their feet. The younger generation is what brings us forward. We're still here. And the people who are, who are at the forefront of looking after us was once the younger generation. And um, as long as we are raising the younger generations to have decorum, to have peace in their heart, to love one another, and to never forget, then we'll be all right. History will always be history. And changes will come from ourselves and the way how we interact with each other and treat each other. That is that, 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 is that circle of life, unfortunately. And as long as there's amazing songs like this, you can never forget. It, has, it will always have a large impact. For that reason, I salute you. Boomer! I'm cool.